Today is a good freaking day. It's Friday. It is Friday. I'm excited. We're playing Skyrim. I'm so damn excited. This has been so fun. It's been wonderful to get a replay of this game, so... <clears throat> Hope everyone's enjoying it. I'm freaking enjoying it. Um, I don't really know what we're going to do today. Maybe some side quests. Maybe Ooh, Thieves Guild, actually. We just got started on Thieves Guild, so... I think we could definitely jump into that. Um, that'd be pretty fun. We could do the Thieves Guild. Maybe that's what we'll do. Maybe we'll learn how to be sneaky. I've been avoiding it the entire game. So maybe we'll do it. We're here. We can try. Could be fun. Could be fun. But let's uh let's hop over to it and uh get into it. I had so much fun playing yesterday. And being Sea of Stars yesterday. That was fantastic. I'll say it a million times over. Go buy that game. Go play that game. <laughs> it is worth every penny. Huh. I suppose I can work with your face. After all, the sculptor cannot always choose the finest clay. Oh, wait, hold on. What? What is happening? I assumed you were here to see me about your face. To have it sculpted into something more artful than nature has bestowed upon you. That was not my intention, so, no. are you here as a client? Shall I remake your face? No. She can just change how we look? That's kind of cool. Didn't know that was in the game. Actually, yeah, I think I do remember that. Um, I'll have to think about it. Indeed. It is no small thing to submit yourself to the flesh sculptor's knife. I don't like that. Flesh sculptor? That doesn't sound nice. Change it. I can remake your face, if that's what you desire. I do not practice my art for free, however. I doubt you can afford my services. Oh, you I can afford it. Vagabond about you. I have lots of money. <laughs> I can definitely afford it, but I don't want it. it is no small thing to submit Leave me alone. Alright. Where are we going? We can do... Oh yeah, we gotta find uh, Esburn. So this is the main quest, and we can do that. This, though... This is Thieves Guild quest. I want to do the main quest. That's what I want to do. Let's go do that. Need advice? Talk to Brynjolf. Got better things to do. Wow. Well, maybe it's because you don't know anything. Freaking rude. Is someone there? Uh, no, I'm not here. Leave me alone. Um, Samantha, go. Balmore? What the hell are you doing down here? Uh... He was flying. Yeah. Um... Nothing good. I was really hoping for some good stuff. Oh god. Yo, Samantha puts in the work. You're good stuff. I like you. Okay. Nord. Man had a gold necklace on him. That's about all he had, though. There's some bread. I do like bread. Let's see. Anything else good? Oh, that looks like a trap. Okay. 
I want to knock that down just to see. Is that a giant circle? No. Okay. Thought I went in a circle there for a second. Elmen Bracers of Major Smithing. I'll take that for when we're doing stuff. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I'm not gonna wear them ever unless we're we're smacking the the anvil, but I'll take that. Oh, money. I'm a big fan of money. Oh wait, iron axe of burning. What are these little chests? Do they have money? All about the loot. Ah, ah, money. The septum. It's worth it. Give me it. Okay. Where's this guy at? He's way in here. Way down in the rat race. Oh, hey, buddy. Not very good. A little bit of loot here. No. Some loot in here. Cabbages. A little potion hanging out. Sneaky, sneaky. can unlock this. Looks like we need to go up there. So let's just do a little look around. <laughs> no, never find me. That was disturbing. I didn't like that at all. Who's laughing? Um. Hello? Oh, these guys are they're not mean. No. They're not trying to kill me. It's crazy. Their fires lit up the night all across Lake Rumere, like stars come to earth. It was beautiful, really. That's okay. I mean, if if you say so. Never should have come here. Oh, um sorry. Die, damn you. I didn't uh I thought it wasn't steel. That's my bad. Um, uh, if I give them back to you, will you just be my friend? Here. Um, I didn't mean to, I promise. Uh, here. And... Where's the other one? Here. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Leave me alone. Can we be friends? Ah! I didn't mean to. I'm sorry. Oh, no. Well, we're already- we're in deep now. I hope we didn't ruin our quest and we're gonna have to, like, restart. Who's this guy? The cook? Jeff's hat. Oh, I want that. I definitely want that. Who's he? Who? Oh, she's deaf. Okay. I won't kill you, I'm sorry. I didn't want to kill anyone. I wanted to give him back his stuff. Go away. Esburn? Open the door, I'm a friend. I just murdered all of your friends, but I'm your friend. What? No, that's not me. I'm not Esburn. I don't know what you're talking about. Whoops. 
It's okay, Delphine sent me. The Thalmor have found you. You need to get out of here. That's why the Thalmor were down here. Okay. Delphine? How do you... So you finally found her? And she led you to me? That's, a, that's am, right. Caught like a rat in a trap. That is why this is called the rat... The rat tunnels or rat cave or whatever it is. Rat... Rat sewers. Rat undergrowth. I don't remember what it's actually. Rat race? No. It's something. Rat something. Yes, it's all clear. Delphine. Need your help to stop the dragons. I'm one of the blades have been searching for you. I'm Dragonborn. It seems like telling him a lot of information. There are Thalmor agents in the Ratway. Ratway! There we go. We found it. So Delphine keeps up with the fights after all these years. He sure does. You better come in and tell me how you found me and what you want. Um. Th this will just take a moment. Okay. I'm sorry I killed your friends. This one always. There we go. Murdered them all. How many locks does this guy have? Make Jesus. Now we can talk. That's a lot. So Delphine keeps up the fire. I mean, I guess he's being oh, hunted by is. the Thalmor, so. I thought she'd have realized it's hopeless by now. I tried to tell her years ago. What do you mean it's hopeless? Haven't you figured it out yet? What more needs to happen before you all wake up and see what's going on? Aldwin has returned just like the prophecy said. The dragon from the dawn of time who devours the souls of the dead. No one can escape his hunger, here or in the afterlife. Alduin will devour all things and the world will end. Nothing can stop him. Ah, I tried to tell them. They wouldn't listen. Fools. It's all come true. All I could do was watch our doom approach. Well, that doesn't sound good. Alduin, the dragon who's raising the others? Yes, yes. You see, you know, but you refuse to understand. Yes. Yes. You're talking about the literal end of the world. Oh, yes. It's all been foretold. The end has begun. Alduin has returned. Only a dragonborn can stop him. That's me. But no dragonborn has been known for centuries. But me? It seems that the gods have grown tired of us. They've left us to our fate as the plaything of Aldwin the World Eater. It's not hopeless, Hesburn. I'm Dragonborn. I am. What? You are? Can it really be true? Dragonborn? Then, then there is hope. The gods have not abandoned us. We must, we must, we must go. Quickly now. Take me to Delphine. We have much to discuss. Sounds good. The moment. I must gather a few things. Uh, yeah, you gather things. I'm gonna gather things too. I have to escort them all the way to Riverwood? Oh my god. That's pretty annoying. That's, qu that's quite the hike. It's gonna be a bit. Kid. One moment, I know. What are you doing, sir? Yes. Give me these. Give me that. Well, Eaver tails. Uh, I'm I'm looting your uh house, sir. You don't want to take any of this stuff, but I sure do. Water of stones, no. Gold slang, no. No, no, no. Hmm. Um, Book of Daedra, no. Anything good? There's so many books in here. Um, Amulet of Kings? I was hoping some of these had some good stuff in here. Magic from the Sky. Children of the Sky. The Dragon War. What is happening? Is being attacked by books. I 
Okay. Um. Nothing good there. You have anything in this? No. Yes. That'll take. Yes. Bucket. The dragon break? Oh, okay. I was I was wondering where Vivi went. She was she was at my feet and then she got up. Back on the couch. Yes. Ink pot. No. Okay. Potion health, let's get out of here. Looks like we got everything. Time to escape. What was that? Oh god. More Thalmor. Horse meat? How did you get horse meat down here? Oh my god! Yo. Home Slice has magic. That's kind of nice. You got a lot of health, my guy. Elven Dagger. Salt Pile. Okay. Hell yeah. Nice. Nice, nice. Me, I'm here. Let's go. And we're gonna get that XP right here. Or not. Oh my god. Well, we are getting XP. It's happening. It's just not happening very well. Cool. Come on, game. There we go. We did it. Master lock pickers. Um. I'm sorry. No, don't attack her. My guy! You don't have to kill her! No! She wasn't doing anything, man. You don't have to do that. S burn. S burn. Could have just left her alone. Oh, Jesus Christ. More Thalmor. Come on, Esburn. I know you're old, but you gotta move it. If he dies, I'm, I'm gonna be upset. Um... Uh, no. Go away. Getting too old for this. Y you are getting old. You're right. You are an old man. That's okay, though. Get out of the way, though. Got get out of the way. Thank you. Crotchety old man. I just had to. I had to know. I had to do it. Alright, let's get out of the rat way. This place is a burden. The ragged flag. The Ragged Flagon. What a name. Come back later. I may have some work for you. If you're looking oh. for conversation, the flagon isn't the place. Oh, um, okay, I'm sorry. We, we can go. We can go. It's no problem.
Uh, come on, bud. Come on. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I almost killed him. Can we get out a different way? No. Okay. Avoid the trap. Come on, Esburn. Don't be dumb. Don't be like me. I'm just a big dumb work. Me hit things with my axe. Okay. Do we make it? Yo, some cheese! Alright. I think we're getting out of here. Whoa, am I going in circles? Hold on. Wait a second. I was I was definitely going in circles. That was a bad time. Bad time. All right, we gotta make it all the way to. Um, do we have to run him there? Or can we quick quick travel with him? Let's let's um. Oh, what the hell? You. I'd say that word, but it's not nice. Javari's no. Alright, what does she what does she got on here? I have good reason to believe the target will be coming to Riften in the next few days. Discretion is preferred, but elimination of the target is of the highest priority. The usual restrictions on exposure are lifted. You will be reassigned outside Skyrim if necessary. Without penalty. Do not fail me. E. The hell is E? You'll have to speak up. I'm a little deaf in my right ear. Oh, he's got info. He's got some hot info here. Well, they've been hunting down blades since the Great War, on general principle. But if you mean me, now in particular, maybe they've started to get an inkling of what the return of the Clankins means. I don't suppose they want the world to end any more than we do. Or at least, they'd prefer to end it on their terms. Yeah, they're probably going to end it on their terms, because they're horrible. Horrible? Horrible, horrible people. Let's do, do a little scoot forward. Get a little bit more comfortable here. We got some gaming to do. What happened on the 30th of Frostfall? It was a cold day. The end of Frostfall is nearly winter in the Jelor Mountains. We heard the news at Cloud Ruler by Courier, riding hard from the Imperial City. 30th of Frostfall, 171. 30 years ago. The Great War started that day. The Thalmor ambassador delivered ah. to the Emperor Titus Mead, the head of every blade's agent within the Old Mary Dominion. I knew that day that it was truly the beginning of the end. Okay. We should keep moving. A little bit of lore. Nice. I do love me some lore. I do love me some lore. Okay, so let's let's quick save and then um, let's try and fast travel. Because I don't want to run all that way. But if we have to, we have to, you know? God damn it. That's so annoying. Oh, never mind. He just didn't load in. <laughs> All right. Nice. That saves me a lot of a lot of problems. Wonder what it's like for those Thalmor now that they've been taken down a notch. Oh yeah, I took him down a notch. I've I've murdered lots of Thalmor. And I will keep murdering Thalmor. We hate them. All right, Esburn. Who dest destroyed this entire area? Why, it's good to see you. 
It's oh. been a long time. I did. <laughs> it's good to see you too, Esper. It's been uh. too long, old friend. Too long. Well, then. You made it safe and sound. Good. Come on. I have a place we can talk. Orgnar, hold down the bar for a minute, will you? That was funny. Yeah, sure. This way. Quit peeking. Okay. As Esper, you gotta get out of the way, my guy. Let's see what Esbern has to say. Okay. Now then, I assume you know about. Oh yes, Dragonborn, indeed. Yes. Oh, this changes everything. Of course, there's no time to lose. We must locate. Let me show you. I know I had it here somewhere. Esbern, what? Give me just a moment. Um, ah, here it is. Come, let you see. No, let here. me just walk Spy into this table really, temple. really quick, and I'll find it. Constructed around one of the main Akaviri military camps in the Reach during their conquest of Skyrim. Do you know what he's talking about? Shh. Why would I know? This is where they built Aldrin's Wall to set down and stone all their acute. Dragon lore. A hedge against the forgetfulness of centuries. A wise and foresighted policy in the event. Despite the far reaching fame of Aldwin's Wall at the time, one of the wonders of the ancient world, its location was lost. Esmer, what are you getting at? You mean, you don't mean to say you haven't heard of Aldwin's Wall? Either of you? Let's pretend we haven't. What's Alduin's Wall, and what does it have to do with stopping the dragons? Alduin's Wall was where the ancient blades recorded all they knew of Alduin and his turn. Part history, part prophecy. His location has been lost for centuries, but I have found it again. Not lost, you see, just forgotten. Okay. The blades' Ooh. archives held so many secrets. I was only able to save a few scraps. So you think that Alduin's wall will tell us how Gain to entrance to Skyhaven Temple. Let's look at this. Scribes notes. I've faithfully copied the following from the annals of the Dragon Guard of Skyhaven Temple for the years 2800 to 2819. Uh, brother, blah, 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 Emperor Castav. Again, order the Dragon Guard to seize hostages from Mark Arth and Hroldan to ensure that the Jarls meet their conscription quotas our master's official protest was denied as usual this will make relations with the local populace more difficult although the hostages are in fact housed and trained with the other acolytes um Upon the outbreak of the Winterhold Rebellion, our master refused orders to send the Dragon Guard out to help suppress the rebellion. The Emperor ordered our supplies to cut off, but we have made arrangements with the local Reachmen and are effectively self-sufficient. The Grandmaster supports our master's actions on the grounds that it violates the Oath of Allegiance. The temple is besieged. The fool Kalian was sent to Winterhold and sacked the city. There was a reason he was denied entry into the Dragon Guard, but the local people do not count the difference. Between Akaviri, all our years of building up trust with the people of Skyrim are now for naught. We learned of the ascension of Ramon II when the siege of the temple was lifted. We provided the honor guard for the Emperor's first visit to Skyrim, a great boost to the temple's prestige. We received reports of a dragon in the east. Scouts were sent immediately, and signs of it were discovered. But it fled at our approach. Survivors have grown weary indeed. We finally received permission from the Emperor to begin construction of Alduin's Wall. 
Craftsmen from the temples across the empire have arrived and begin the great work, overseen by our master. As is only fitting as she is unmatched in her dragon lore. Working on Alduin's wall progress, the master dismissed several craftsmen from a western temple that I do not need to name. They are so well known for a stiff necked pride, which has delayed the work, but there must be no compromise. Alduin's wall is our gift to those that come after us. The Grand Master visited the temple in the summer to view the progress of the wall. He has received compliment or complaints about the expense. But he was no was so impressed by the wall, even in its half finished state, that he gave our master a writ of what requisition under the Emperor's seal there will be no more delays. Further reports of dragons in the east, which could not be verified. In auspicious year, Album's wall was finished. A dragon was located and slain. And Emperor Rahman the second visited the official that visited to officially dedicate the wall. The blood seal was consecrated in the presence of the Dragon Guard of Skyrim, a great honor of which few temples can boast. Well, yes. We're taking that book. There's no guarantee, of course. Skyhaven Temple it is, then. I knew you'd have something for us, Esbern. I know the area of the Reach that Esbern's talking about, near what's now known as Karthspire in the Karth River Canyon. We can meet you there or all travel together. Okay. Your call. Um, what's the best way to get there? From Riverwood? The road south through Falkreath is the most direct route. Or you could catch the carriage from Whiterun to Markarth and then approach from the west. Either way, the reach is wild country these days. The Forsworn are everywhere. Best be careful. I love them. I love the Forsworn. I'll meet you at Carspire. Your call. My Don't worry. I'll get Esbern there in one piece. We'll wait for you near Carthspire. Good luck. Okay. Well, that's good. We finished a little bit of the main quest. Um, what do we got? Uh, ooh, we can undo this. I'm going to keep these, like I said. Um, because... That way we get 17% improved stuff. Probably never coming back here. Well now, that's something to think about. Take care of yourself, Lord Narn. Goodbye. I still don't have fortify one hander, which is kinda sad. You'll be safe. Kinda sad. Um Do we have anything to make? Restore magic. Nice. Let's see. Fortify stamina. Sure. Gives us some XP. I really want to make, um... Let's... Did we get to level 19? We can make, um... The dwarven gear now, can we? Yeah. I want to go buy um, dwarven ingots. Out of my way, stranger! I punch you in the head. Um. Let's see if they have any here. Cause I want to make uh, dwarven gear. And if we're doing that, we might as well put on our Ellen gloves of smithing. Got some good pieces Wait. out here if you're looking to buy. I, I don't claim mm, you need to protect yourself. Maybe not pieces, but if you have dwarven metal, I will buy it. Don't forget to check inside the shop. Let's see if he's got any here. Have you met my father? He's Welcome to the finest weapons and armor. Oh, baby. Okay. Let's do it. Let's make some hot gear. 
We need to make gloves. We need to make chess piece. I think that's it, because we don't need help. I help my father in more ways than people do. Oh, baby. Dwarven. What, what else do we need? We need steel on top of it. Shh. Taki mushrooms. All right. You think you have all steel? The finest weapons and armor. Uh, she's got some. I think we have some too, but that might be enough. I don't think it took very many. Dwarven gear. Dwarven gauntlets. Leather strips. We have leather strips. Let's go get some leather strips. So we're gonna make... Uh, gloves, chest. Because we have boots already. We have helm. Gloves and chest. And we need to make a dwarven axe to do that quest. So. Sure. Um, awesome. Yes? I, I, I did not speak to you. Ma'am. Dwarven armor. And Dwarven gauntlets. We're gonna be a freaking dwarf. Apparel. Gauntlets. Oh wait, we need to put these on so we can upgrade them. Um Armor. Hell yeah. Now we look sweet. Got some good pieces. I don't claim. The finest weapons and armor. Here, take my junk. Don't forget to check. And get off the workbench. I got stuff to do. I can upgrade that to 45. Oh my god. Oh, baby. We're beefy now. We are beefy now. We got tons of armor. Um, so we need to make an axe. Yeah? I think. Let's see. Let's look at the quest just to make sure, but I'm pretty sure that's what it is. It's bring a dwarven war axe to... Yep. Okay. Dwarven. Borax. Perfect. Can we, um, upgrade our weapon, too? Oh. Oh, no. We, we can't do enchanted stuff yet. Damn. That sucks. It's fine. It's fine. Let's dump some of this stuff off quick, and then we'll, uh, do some quests. Now that we're freaking stacked, we're beefy. We're a beefy boy now. We got stuff to sell too. Um, miscellaneous that can go in there. My dwarven ingots can go in there. Perfect. Let's do it. Let's do it. Um, I think I, I can, I got some stuff to sell. Let's, let's make some money. Bellathorn, what's going on? Some may call this junk. Me, I call them treasures. Boots. Don't need any of those. Don't need that. The chef hat, we're keeping that. I need that. Don't need those daggers. Nope. 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 All right. Sweet. Okay. What quest we got? What, what should we do? What should we do? We can. We can go do this. I don't know where that's at. I think this is in Markarth. 
if I'm correct. Maybe not, though. Um... Oh god, we can we can do Meridia's beacon. I wonder if we can do this now. We can we can maybe do the uh the seducers bandits. People have forgotten. We're a little bit beefier than we used to be, so maybe we can do that. What do we got? We were doing the bandit quest, right? I think that sounds good. Defeat the seducers. Which I think that was that was um way up here. Um We did not go there. We've been to Windhelm, we've been hit here to the stables. Let's try and do this. Quick save, because the last time we were up here we got absolutely de destroyed by these bandits. I mean, actually wrecked. So we're going to try and do our best. Yo, how do you swim in all this armor? Never understood that. You'd be so damn heavy. You'd be so heavy. Unbelievably heavy. What's this? Just the, the the tree. Okay, I thought it was a mushroom. All right, let's go murder these guys. Why do I have two markers on my map? Seems kind of weird. I'm just supposed to be going after the one. Oh, because I have that marked. Aha! Makes sense. Makes sense. Where do I gotta go? Holy crap. Way up the side of this mountain. Gotta be like this guy, Billy Goat. Billy Goat it up. How you climb up this mountain so easy? Sir, get out of my way. Sir, get out of my get out of my way. The goat be going, man. He's going. Wolves? Yep. Here they come. Die. Oh, it's just one ice wolf? Okay, that's not that bad. take iron you know I think if, if I didn't have a mod I think the one that I would want is to be able to just instant mine things that crap is annoying ah here we go let's quick save and our friend died so let's do our best. Oh. 
Come on now. Oh, that guy just absolutely destroyed my friend. Okay, um... Let's take a second here. Let's take a second. These guys are kind of annoying. We're gonna drink this. Um... We're gonna drink this. And this. And... Heal up a little bit. The next thing we're gonna do, really quick, is I forgot to redo this. So that'll help. God damn it. Okay, we got potions. We got potions. It's fine. That's what potions are for. Get murdered. That's why we have potions. They're useful. Dark mace. What is that? Yo. Withering moon. Dark Seducer's Gauntlets. Where are these guys getting this gear? Seducer's Bandit Leave. Okay. More Gauntlets. Dark Seducer's Shield. That thing looks sick. God, what? What is happening? I see. Just a little, uh, little archer in here doing, doing their thing. Get murdered. Dark dagger. Dark bow. Dark arrow. Oh, here we go. Dark seducers. Cool stuff. I like collecting gear. Dark seducers armor. Oh, do we get another friend? We got a friend from the last camp. Um, let's see. I I have too much stuff on me. Do we have weapons? I don't need two of these. Okay, there we go. Uh, dark mace, imperial soldier. Oh, this guy got murked. Still ring it. Backpack. Hold on. Oh man, this guy also got murked. Oh my god, it's a little friend. Get out of there, little friend. Demented. That doesn't sound good. Are you okay? Those bandits m must have caged you. You're the second bug of your kind I've come across recently. It'd be cruel to leave here. Would you like to follow me? This is probably a bad idea, but you if you want, you can follow me. Um, Do you want to come with me? Yo. We got a new friend. Wait for me at home. 
Now we got two bugs. Hell yeah. Note, can't believe we carried this bug the whole way here. Cage and all. Always afraid it's going to find a way through the bars and eat me in my sleep. Um... It's so cute. Look at his little glowy back. He's going he's going to the home. He's going Oh my god, a great sword. Oh, he's hiding in the hay. That thing looks sick. We don't use two handed weapons, but you know. It is what it is. We're too heavy now, so that kinda sucks. Uh if we can just eat the cheese, that's fine. Um, uh, what is in my bags that is weighing me down? I don't need this. <laughs> Wolf belts, get out of here. Um, you know, that sucks. Oh, here we go. We can get rid of one of these. Oh my god, it's still two? Jesus. Jesus. I just I just want to take everything back. Um Man. I like collecting gear. We'll have to come back. We'll just drop that for now. For now, we'll come back. It looks so cool. Oh, more cheese. Okay, we gotta we gotta go back. Um, go back and talk to. I thought I read it already. Read the journals. Um. Here we go. This is the uh, saints one. Oh, there's more, there's more bandit camps. Now this is what I call easy coin. I'm proud to be the one of the saints. Every few days, Rasad comes down on the road and his wares are ours for the taking. If you don't take everything, mind you, if he don't got nothing to sell, he can't stay in business. And then where would he be? Or where would we be? We just skin a bit off the top each time. Kenthal should be happy with our latest take. He'll be leaving his camp up near Karth Waston to pay us a visit soon. Those damn seducers were eating in our profits, into our profits, until we drove them off up north. Other merchants pass through those parts, so maybe they'll stay gone. Oops. Wrong one. Seducers. Um. Dark work this. But, does it ever pay well? Every... Once every few days, a merchant comes galloping through, defenseless as a babe. We seducers always do our good deed and lighten their load before we let them pass. It's the least we can do. Moving north was the best thing we ever did. Leave or sign to the milk drinkers of Whiterun, or as they call themselves, the Saints. They're probably still hounding him on the road to Markarth. Okay. So, I mean... It looks like now we have to go kill the other ones, but they're probably going to be even harder to kill. So... That sucks. Let's, um... Let's go sell stuff. Or put stuff away. Oh yeah, they're like, right up the road. I didn't even realize that. Where are the other ones? Oh, I don't have it marked. Um... So we can go do this. We need to sell stuff. Oh, and then this is the other one. The other Saints Band account. Cool. Alright. It's a white room. We'll put our stuff away. Oh, God. Oh, I thought I was, I thought I was overburdened. But, uh, I hit caps lock on accident. Oops. 
Whoops. Um. Okay, we put our cool gear up here. I really hope those two bugs don't eat each other. That'd be unfortunate. Um. Weapons. Dark bow. We can put this away. I just like collecting this stuff, because... You know, why not? Uh, I think that's it. All right. We can put our smithing gloves. Did we put them in here? Maybe we should just put our smithing gloves like... Down. We don't gotta, you know what I mean? We don't gotta, we don't gotta dig around for them. They can just sit here on the table. Every time we go smith. Oh no. Every time we go smith, they'll just be sitting there waiting for us. Perfect. I like it. Um... Do we have anything to sell quick, and then we'll see what we can do for a quest. I don't think we're gonna... We're, we could go check out those bandit camps, but... Um... Hmm... Maybe we'll just go do main quest for a little bit. I want to progress that a good bit. Because otherwise, you know, not that we need to do the main quest, but we might as well get it done. Or get parts of it done. Take a good look around. I'm otherwise, sure I'll just get carried away with other side stuff. Every Some may call this junk. Me, I call them treasures. Let's see. I need that. You can have these dark arrows, though. I don't want those. Amulet of Kinnereth. Don't need that. And... Oh, man. You're poor. Belathor. Get to work, man. Sell some stuff. Jesus. How else am I going to get paid? Okay, where's our quest? Way over here. Have we been to Markarth yet? No. Oh, we've been to the stables, though. And we've been here. Why have we been over here? Oh, because I had a quest here, I think. Oh, no, we were over here because we did the drunk quest. I keep forgetting that we did that. But we didn't finish it, but we started it. <laughs> And it just kind of sent us uh, to places. But, oh, and we did Red Eagle. Right, right, right. We got tons of good stuff. Um, it's just a hop, skip, and a, a jump down the road. Let's go. There's two camps over here, though. Oh, Forsworn. These dirty, dirty men. And women. I don't like the Forsworn. I think they're weird. I think they're creepy. I think they're frickin' rude, that's what I think. Get out of here, you frickin' jerk. Leave me alone. I don't know what you're doing. You can't just you can't just spin around in circles and expect it to work, man. It's not that's not how this works. Holy crap! I'm getting blasted by fireballs, though. Jesus Christ.
Holy hot damn. Oh, those, those hurt. I drank the wrong ones. Ow. Uh, that one? Bam. Nice. Get him. Get him, Samantha. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Oh, hey, Esburn. Thanks for showing up, my guy. What a trooper. Oh, he is messing that guy up. Get chopped. Again, I don't know what this guy, guy is doing, but he is just flailing. Do we do it? We clear them out? Oh, these guys. Okay. Okay. We'll get them. I'm not that worried. The force warrants suck butts. Yeah, they're all about the butt sucking. What the hell? Now we got a dragon? Blood dragon, huh? Alright, guy, get down here. Don't do that, that's not nice. Yes, come down. No, don't do that, you freaking rude. Please land. Oh, I was like, Esper, did you die? Get out of here. That's not what I want. Cool. Now we gotta do all that over. We got absolutely destroyed. Maybe we should get some potions. Why sick? Am I dying? No. Why are you tell me I look sick? Part I have s long as you clean up. A little wheat and bl we have plenty of ingredients for sale too. Maybe a hardy Nord like you doesn't need a cure all, huh? No, I don't. Potion? Take a look. I want to know what you have though. Um, would you like to buy some of my potions that I don't need? No, oh, because she's poor. Take a look. Um, we're just going to buy some healing potions. And then. Oh, she's got a bunch of ingredients. Do we just do this? Um. Nice. Hell yeah. Come back anytime if you need a remedy. Let's make some stuff. Restore health. Nice. Restore magic. You'll find tonics, 
salves, poultices, and potions on my shelves. Um, browns to your heart's content. If we use resist magic, is that good against dragons? Look at all that, though. Look at that XP. Pumping it. Pumping XP. Purple. Purple mountain flower. 164. I am just picking flowers like crazy. Holy crap. Fortify magic. Not gonna lie, I uh, have not done this for a while, so we got a ton of stuff. Time to eat 27 cheese wheels? Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Look at this. 40. Look at all this XP. Oh my god, that was beautiful. XP farm. If there's anything I can help you with, you have but to ask. You look rather pale. And now I have 800 potions that I never am going to use. Pardon me, but do I detect a case of the rattles? No, I don't have diseases. Why is she always saying that? That's so rude. About everybody in here. Give a holler if you have any questions. Everything's for sale, my friend. Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. What you got? Oh, Belthor, you're poor. How am I supposed to sell all this junk to you? Yeah, yeah, probably. Honestly, wouldn't surprise me at all. He seems like a scummy person. Actually, she, seem, she seems like a really nice person. But, you know, hey, you gotta make business. I got so much crap now. Let's go to um, the Riverwood Trader and uh, unload some of these potions. I don't need 900 resist magic potions. A dragon to attack Why? Why this? No I definitely don't need that many. Thank you. Take a look. What do you got? I don't really care what you have, but I have all of these, and you can sell these to your customers. Here you go, bud. Oh my god. Why, why don't you want to buy my, my stuff? Why don't you have 1,200 gold, man? Um, where's my other ones that I have like 800 of? Resist magic. Oh, we can get rid of these. Boom. Easy. Easy gold. How about uh, fortify magic? We don't need 10 of those. Push them slow. That's worth 1,200 gold. That's insane. I'm making the money. Turns out this is the best way to make money. There's probably better ways, actually, but this is really good. Sixty-seven potions of resist frost. Oh my god. Whoops. I think I broke the, the game. I made too many. Is there anywhere else we can go sell? I think we can go... There's a potion place here. 
So maybe we can sell to them. We're just bouncing around towns. Selling stuff. How you, this is how you make money. We're a traveler. BB is scratching to go out, but I think she's, um... I think she's just being a butt. We walked before... Before, uh... Welcome to this... Watch it! You get out of the way of the door. I'm trying to come in. I'm a customer. If you're looking for... You were there for Rogvir's execution. Uh, nasty bit of business. Perhaps, but necessary. My cousin Fura is somewhere out there in Skyrim right now, fighting Ulfric Stormcloak and his dams insurrectionists. Okay. She wouldn't have to be there at all if it weren't for Rogvir. And my aunt wouldn't have to worry about her daughter. Why were they executing him? You really don't know. He I do, Ulfric but um, let's hear about it. Solitude. Ulfric rides in, murders the High King, and Rogvir lets him ride right back out. How do you take your mind off something like that? Most people head over to the Winking Skeever. If you're not interested in music or drink, you can at least talk to Corpulus. He can fill you in on any of the latest gossip. Oh, okay. Uh, I want to sell you stuff. Where's your mom? Mama. It's good to see a fresh <laughs> face. You would so you <laughs> Get out of here. If you're not going to let me buy and sell use. stuff. Are you at the counter? Um. Where am I? Money makers. Here we go. There we go. Thank you for all your money. I appreciate it. I hope you'll never be able to sell those because they're resist frost potions. Not a single person is going to want to buy those. Okay. How much, um... How much weight do I have? A lot. Maybe I'll just throw some of those potions in my in my chest, and we'll uh, we'll move on. Oh, look! It's my little bug friend. Hey, buddy. Oh, look at both of them. They're so cute. Okay, we can we can throw potions up here. This works. This works. Uh, store. Store. Enchanter's trout. We don't need that on us. Potions of slow. We don't need that on us. Um, don't need that, those, that, fortify stamina, fortify two-hander we don't need, um, potion of regeneration, that's decent, we don't need these, we don't need these, we'll take, we'll keep these because those are kind of handy, I mean it's a little bit, it's not like a lot, but it's a little bit of resistance. Store health. These ones are garbage. I use those on, on accident, everyone. It's because I used um something else in the potion mix that did damage to magic on top of it. And, uh, oops. So it's not very good. Potion of the Warrior. That's good. Solution of health. That's fine. Strength is fine. I'll keep one of these just in case. That. And that. Okay, we're good. How are we looking now? 200. That was 40. 40 pounds. 40 pounds. Of goddamn potions. Holy crap. Holy crap. Okay. We have a quest to do. Let's go do this quest. Since we got... Absolutely destroyed last time. Now we have potions. Dwarven Delve Room on the way. Yeah. 
Evie, you gotta wait, girly. Yeah, we'll go later. You just went out. Like, two hours ago. That's close enough. Is it close enough, though? I'm not scared of you. I sure would like my friends to be here, though. If you could get over here, that'd be nice. I'll show you close enough. Diced. Dwarven Warhammer? Huh. Dog. This was way easier than the last time. Oh, here comes the dragon. Here he comes. Oh, baby, we level. Oh, buddy. We're feeling spicy now. Get out of here. I'm a freaking beast. Oh, what the hell? Why is there a hag over here? Hag Raven, get out of here. How? And a dragon? Absolutely not. We're we're level one. Health. Thank you. Um Did we learn this yet? No, that's at sixty. Uh that's awful. Um we can get this though. Soon. Soon enough. Oh, we could get block. Deflect arrows. There we go. That's pretty good to have. Quit it. Quit casting. Okay, where is that dragon at? Ugh. I asked. It's my fault. I asked. Goddamn friends. They just now want to come over here and help? They're being worthless. What are you doing? <laughs> that dragon flying over the top is really annoying. Oh shit, I need stamina. I also need to heal. What the hell? Didn't I just heal? Did I get smacked in the head?
Alright, Mr. Dargan, where'd you go? Let's get the hell out of this tiny space. Oh, he's up here. Damn it. I'm gonna make it to him and he's gonna fly away. Oh god. I'm coming. Oh, I'm coming for you. Ow. I knew it. Don't you fly away. Now that I have you in my in my sights, don't you fly. He almost killed me. He almost smashed me. Shit. Put on the poison damage. Oh god. Oh no. Do I have any heals? Solution of health. That gives us a chance. If we can shield bash here, do we win? Yeah, get off this hill. This is my hill. I'm the king. Give me your bones. Those delicious, delicious bones. Good job, man. You did a lot running on this rock. You're you're so great. Esburn, maybe you should retire. Okay. Is there any loot actually up here? Because the Forsworn are kind of worthless. They have like no gear. It's all garbage. Is this where I need to go? Let's see. Gain entrance to Skyhaven Temple. Yeah, I think I think we discovered it. Heart Spire. Okay. We still have We have a ton of crap on us, but we discovered this. So let's go back. Dump off our dragon bones, because those weigh 800 pounds. They weigh 800 pounds. Oh, yes, hey, buddy. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. My hands only, you say? Let's see here. There's a new museum opening up in Dawnstar. The owner is asking me to hand out invitations to travelers. Looks like that's it. A museum? Uh, so. What do you need? Fancy schmancy. Get out of here. I already yes. told... I... I killed you. And I killed you, and I killed your master. Get out of the town. Yes. I murdered all of them. Um, I don't remember where I put my dragon bones. This one? Yeah. Sweet. Um, why are you in my house? Sweet. Okay. I think we're good now. I think we can move back. Let's, let's double check really fast, but I, yeah, we're at 240. Can't just casually carry, um, this oh, one. Sorry. 
nothing. I'm just not strong enough. To be fair though, like carrying what do I what was what is my weight? 340. Carrying 340 pounds. You'd have to be a god. You know how heavy that would that's that's so much weight to have on your body while you're just like traveling around. I hiked the Grand Canyon. I hiked the Grand Canyon. This is like forever ago. This is in like 2015. Um, with like, I don't know, a 25 pound pack? 30? Yeah. I think it was like 25 pounds. And that was just like food and, and extra clothes and stuff. Because we did it in three days. But like, 350 pounds on your back? That's carrying a massive per- that's carrying like two normal people. Yeah? For- forever. Just carrying them around. That's so much weight. <laughs> you would have to do a lot of squats. You have to be the most jacked man in the world. That is a hefty burden. A hefty, hefty burden. Uh, it wasn't my imagination. Oh, Samantha. No. Quit it. Stop casting. That's how it's done. Are you foe? Friend or foe? Oh, that's mine. Okay. Poisons. Potions. Nice. Beehive husk. The nice thing about these guys is they do have ingredients on them. Because they're weirdos. They always got the weird stuff on them. Come on, Samantha. We got things to do. Potatoes. Oh, baby. A chest. Iron dagger? Like, what? Why? In what world do I need an iron dagger right now? How is that useful? Sometimes this game and it's loot. It's just so dis disappointing. So sad and disappointing. You just kill a, a giant uh, dragon and you get a dagger. Here you go. Have fun. Okay. I think we need to go up here. These pillars must have something to do with it. Yes. These are Akaviri symbols. Here, let's see. You have the symbol for king and warrior. And of course the symbol for dragonborn. That's the one that appears to have a sort of arrow shape pointing downward at the bottom. Oh, that one? Um, is there a clue here? Do, do you have a clue? Be getting close. We should proceed cautiously. Is it maybe we should turn them all the dragonborn? Yes, that's it. The symbol on the middle pillar. Whatever you did, it worked. Let's see what those old blades. Why does that work? I don't know. Because I'm the dragonborn, obviously. Why did I know that was going to work? Oh god. That looks like traps. It looks like traps. Um Oh, I see. It's it's just the ones with the arrows. Yeah. Cool. I got it. I know this. This is an easy puzzle. Wait. Why are you stopping? 
Wait. No, I have it figured out already. Shut up. Hold on. Oh. Ah, there's a chain. <laughs> uh, uh. I'm a genius. Go, Dragonborn, go. Skyhaven Temple. We made it. What's in here? Ooh, loot! I did get... I don't know if you guys saw this yet. Wonderful. Boom. Nice little new oh. emote. Since I'm obsessed with loot. This is going to be a trap. It's going to be a trap. I know it. Yo, look at that though. Not that we need it because we have that sick helmet from the uh, Barbus quest. But that's kind of cool. It wasn't a trap. Kind of surprising. Ah, here's the blood seal. Another of the lost Akaviri arts. No doubt it's triggered by, well, blood. blood. Your blood, Dragonborn. Look oh, here. that's messed up. I don't want to. I don't want to cut myself. That seems messed up. Let's save. Maybe we'll die. Whoops. That's why I needed the dagger. It makes sense. There's no telling what we might find inside. Guy even temple. I should have brought a bunch of cheese. Whoa. Okay, so that's all the one. Yeah. Where? Where are they at? Come on. Do I need to go up town? No. They're, oh, they're taking forever. They're taking their sweet time. Oh, I don't got all day. All right. I don't got all day. Who's up here? Doors. So this is Alduin. Looks like he's fighting knights. Is this supposed to be me? Walk. Look, here is Alduin. This panel goes back to the beginning of time, when Alduin and the Dragon Cult ruled over Skyrim. Here, the humans rebelled against their Dragon Overlords, the legendary Dragon War. Alduin's defeat is the centerpiece of the war. Ah. See, here is fallen from the sky. The Nord Tongs, masters of the voice, are arrayed against him. So does it show how they defeated him? Isn't that why we're here? Masters ah, of the voice. Patience, my dear. The Akaviri were not a straightforward people. Everything is couched in allegory, and mythic symbolism. Yes, yes. This here, coming from the mouths of the Nord heroes, this is the Akaviri symbol for shout. But there's no way to know what shout is meant. 
You mean they used a shout to defeat Alduin? You're sure? They spoke him Presumably into the abyss. The specific to Kratos, or even Alduin himself. Remember, this is where they recorded all the news of Alduin. So we're looking for a shout then. Damn it. Have you ever heard of such a thing? A shout that can knock a dragon out of the sky? Uh, the Greybeards might know. I sure show shit don't. You're probably right. I was hoping to avoid having to involve them in this, but it seems we have no choice. They know more than you, lady. Like, come on. If they had their way, you do nothing but sit up on their mountain with them and talk to the sky or whatever it is they do. The Greybeards are so afraid of power that they won't use it. Think about it. Have they tried to stop the civil war or done anything no, about No, because Alduin? it's not their job. No. And they're afraid of you, of your power. Trust me, there is no need to be afraid. Think of Tiber Septim. Do you think he'd have founded the Empire if he'd listened to the Greybeards? I mean, th this is this is a true statement right here. The Greybeards may have a point. Power is dangerous. Only if you don't know how to use it. All the great heroes have had to learn to use their power. Those that shrank from their destiny. Well, you've never heard of them, have you? And there are the villains. Those that misused their power. There's always a choice, and there's always a risk. But if you live in fear of what might go wrong, you'll end up doing nothing. Like the gray beards up on their mountain. I better see. All right, lady. Like you, their job is right. not to save Good the world. They've already let you into their little cult. Not likely they'd help. As I don't like her. If we came calling. I don't like her well, at look all. Look around Skyhaven Temple and see what else the old blades might have left for us. It's a better hideout than I could have hoped for. Talos guard you. Here, in the okay, map. Alduin's wall. The prophecy which brought the Alcaviri to Tamriel in the first place, in search of the Dragonborn. Here are the Alcaviri, the blades. You see their distinctive long swords. Now they need their ancient mission fulfilled, as the last Dragonborn contends with Aldrin at the end of time. Are you paying attention, Elfian? You might learn something of our own history. I am paying attention. Um, oh, Vivi's upset. Very good girl. What a good girl. Good doggy. Okay. So, we have to go to the Greybeards. Oh, it turned the the outside turned blue. That's kind of cool. Is there anything in here? Oh, you know we gotta get the loot. It's no bear pelt. Wolf pelt. Just a bunch of hides. Kind of weird. Horker tusk. Hey, you know, sometimes you just gotta keep those horker tusks on ya. You gotta keep that thing on ya. Cool. Not really anything there, though. Over here. Ooh. More chests. Oh, my God. Bro, look at that thing. Look at that thing. Yo. It's not better because we upgraded the, uh, the dwarven stuff, but if we didn't make the dwarven stuff... Holy hot damn. The chest was better though, wasn't it? It was. Dude. 
That's awesome. Oh man, that makes me want to put on the rest of it just because it looks cool. We lose a little bit of armor, but that's pretty sick. I mean, it doesn't really matter though. We, you never really look at yourself. Uh, plus this helmet is so good. We'll wear the chest piece, but that's it. That's it. Just cause it's better. And I need to drop crap. I'm way too heavy. 367. Should we just drop this bad boy? Call it good. Sorry, bud. You're staying here. You can you can rest here forever. All right. Let's get out of here and let's uh let's go back to Hrothgar. I am a blade now. Yeah. <laughs> Not that I'm. I, actually, I don't know if that's nice. I don't like. I don't like. Um. What's her name? I really don't like her. He's kind of a jerk. She makes good points, but... Why are you, why are you gonna talk about the, uh... The graybeards like that? They're just up here living in, living in peace. Living their life. Alright, where's my dog? Where's my dude? Sky up, sky. Got you. Hmm. I need to learn the shout used to defeat Alduin. Where did you learn of that? Who have you been talking to? Oh, he's pissed. He is not happy. He is upset. Does it matter? I can he not figure out by the the fact that I'm wearing a blade's armor? <laughs> That, uh, that that's who helped me? The Blades, of course. They specialize in meddling in matters they barely understand. Their reckless arrogance knows no bounds. They have always sought to turn the Dragonborn from the path of wisdom. Have you learned nothing from us? Would you simply be a tool in the hands of the Blades to be used for their own purposes? Um, the Blades just want to defeat Alduin, don't you? Um, what I want is irrelevant. This shout was used once before, was it not? And here we are again. Vivi's being Have crazy behind me. that Alduin was not meant to be defeated? Those who overthrew him in ancient times only postponed the day of reckoning. They did not stop it. If the world is meant to end, so be it. Let it end and be reborn. Well, goddamn. I mean... It's dark, but I guess it's fair. So you won't help me? No, not now. Not until you return to the path of wisdom. Wow. Was that? That was Parthenax, okay. Uh, forgive me, I was intemperate. I allowed my emotions to cloud my judgment. Master Einarth reminded me of my duty. The decision whether or not to help you is not mine to make. So, can you teach me this shout? No. I cannot teach it to you because I do not know it. It is called Dragonrend, but its words of power are unknown to us. We do not regret this loss. Dragonrend holds no place within the way of the voice. Wait. Wouldn't it be, though? Because it's it's part of the... Doesn't make sense to me. I thought you knew all the words. Um... But not Dragonrend. The knowledge of that shout was lost in the time before history began. Perhaps only its creators ever knew it. 
but I am not the one to speak of it to you. Okay, so what's bad, or what's so bad about Dragon Run? It was created by those who had lived under the unimaginable cruelty of Alduin's dragon cult. Their whole lives were consumed with hatred for dragons, and they poured all their anger and hatred into this shout. When you learn a shout, Yikes. you take it into your very being. In a sense, you become the shout. In order to learn and use this shout, you will be taking this evil into yourself. That's okay. I've done some I've done some pretty bad things, so it can't get much worse. If the shout is lost, how can I defeat Alduin? Patanax, the master of our order, can answer that question, if he so chooses. Uh, who is Parthenax? He is our leader. He surpasses us all in his mastery of the way of the voice. Why haven't I met Parthenax? He lives in seclusion on the very peak of the mountain. He speaks to us only rarely, and never to outsiders. Being allowed to see him is a great privilege. How do I get to the top of the mountain? Only those whose voice is strong can find the path. We will teach you a shout to open the way to Parthenax. Oh, wait, hold on. They're going to teach me the shout. Nice. Oh, I can take these? Hold on. You know we gotta get that cheese. They got so many books up here. But I guess they don't really have anything else to do except for sit here and read. Where'd they go? Outside? Bum bum bum. What are they going to teach me? You're slow. I just want to learn. to Parthenax lies through this gate. I will show you how to open the way. Okay. Cool. I didn't know this was like this fast. I couldn't... I, I don't remember this at all. Learn the clear skies shout. It's been so long. Clear skies. Okay. I grant you my understanding of clear skies. This is your final gift from us, Dragonborn. Use it well. Clear skies. Cool. Path to Parthenax is perilous, not to be embarked upon lightly. Keep moving, stay focused on your goal, and you will reach the summit. Okay. Sounds like a plan. Let's do it. Let's go see the mighty Parthenax. Go, go, go. <laughs> I think I scared the goat. How does he survive up here?
What if we just fell off the mountain? Wouldn't that be funny? We just got blasted off the mountain? Oh god. Get out of here! Sir, I'm trying to meet Parthenax. Get out of my way. not cool. They hurt. I'm getting, I'm getting messed up. The way their butt moves up is hilarious. <laughs> uh, poor little goats. Poor little goats. Ow! further we got. This is worse than the 10,000 steps or whatever. 4,000 steps? 8,000? I don't remember what he said. Look. Oh, we're almost there. Maybe. Don't blow me off. Don't do it. Oh, thank God. This would be quite the workout. No wonder I can carry 380 pounds. I'm freaking hiking up mountains all damn day. Hey, it's a Dargan. Hi, Mr. Parthenax. I am Parthenax. Who are you? What brings you to my Strunmach, my mountain? I'm Dovahkiin. <laughs> I wasn't expecting you to be a dragon. I am as my father Akatosh made me, as are you, Dovahkiin. Tell me, why do you come here, Volan? Why do you intrude on my meditation? You think you've done every side quest, but don't think you've actually completed the main story? Hey, you know, the, I think that's a lot of people's um, story of getting to play Skyrim. Because there's so much stuff to freaking do that uh, you just never do the main quest. Which is why... I, when I played Fallout 4, I pretty much, like, just focused on the main story, because if I did other stuff, I was never going to get to it. So I'm kind of doing that with this. But, uh, you know, we're doing side stuff, too. I need to learn the Dragon Wrench shout. Can you teach me? Hmm. Drem. Patience. 
There are formalities which must be observed at the first meeting of two of the Dove. By long tradition, the Elder speaks first. Hear my Thum. Feel it in your bones. Match it if you are Dovahkiin. Oh, I, I am Dovahkiin. I can't do that. <laughs> I I haven't learned how to do that one yet. <laughs> oh baby. Now I can breathe fire. It looks so yes. weak compared to this. Of lost mool, the dragon blood runs uh, strong in you. It is long since I had the funny. pleasure of speech with one of my own kind. Wait, where are you going? You have made your way here to me. No easy task for a jaw, mortal. Even for one of Dova's source, dragon blood. What would you ask of me? Can you teach me the dragon run shout? Ah, I have expected you, Proda. You would not come all this way for Tinvak with an old Dova. No, you seek your weapon against Alduin. That's damn right. That is damn right. The Greybeards didn't want me to come at all. Do you know Dragonrend or not? <laughs> Do you know it or not? I mean, I'm a dick. The, the Greybeards didn't want me to come at all. Mm, yes. They are very protective of me. Bachlan Fadon. But I do not know the Thum you seek. Croesus, it cannot be known to me. Your kind, Jor, mortals, created it as a weapon against the Dove. The dragons. Our Hadrime, our minds, cannot even comprehend its concepts. That's interesting. How can I learn it then? Drem, all in good time. First, a question for you. Why do you want to learn this Thum? I need to stop Alduin? Yes, Alduin, Zembach, the elder brother, gifted, grasping, and troublesome, as is so often the case with firstborn. <laughs> but why? Why must you stop Alduin? Um, the prophecy says that only the dragonborn can stop him. Mm, true. But Kostid, prophecy, tells what may be, not what should be. Kostid's wise words. Ark. Just because you can do a thing does not always mean you should. Hm. Do you have no better reason for acting than destiny? Are you nothing but a plaything of Dez? Of fate. I 
I don't believe in destiny, but I will stop Alduin. And so perhaps your destiny will be fulfilled. Who can say? Desmot Mahus, even to the Dove who ride the currents of time, Alduin believes that he will prevail with good reason, Rachmul. And he is no fool, ni me, Rinnik Gutnol, far from it. He began as the wisest and most far-seeing of us all. But you have indulged my weakness for speech long enough. Croesus, now I will answer your question. Hmm. Do you know why I live here, at the peak of the Monaven, what you name Throat of the World? Nope. No, dragons like mountains, right? <laughs> You now remember that this was the very spot where Alduin was defeated by the ancient tongues. Ah. Varucht Unslad. Perhaps none but me now remember how he was defeated. Using the dragon wrench shout, right? Mm, yes and no. Viknuznikaron. Alduin was not truly defeated either. If he was, you would not be here today seeking to defeat him. The Nords of those days used the Dragonrend shout to cripple Alduin, but this was not enough. Okmulag Unslad. It was the Kel, the Elder Scroll. They used it to cast him adrift on the currents of time. Ah. An Elder Scroll, what's that? Hmm. How to explain in your tongue? The Dove have words for such things that Jaw do not. It is an artifact from outside time. It does not exist, but it has always existed. Rahwahlan, they are mm, fragments of creation. The Kelle, Elder Scrolls as you name them, they have often been used for prophecy. Yes, your prophecy comes from an Elder Scroll. But this is only a small part of their power. Zofa Suryek. Okay, are you saying the Nords sent Alduin forward in time? Not intentionally. But Some yes. hoped he would be gone forever, forever lost. Maye. I knew better. Tidbo Amativ. Time flows ever onward. One day he would surface. Which is why I have lived here. For thousands of mortal years, I have waited. I knew where he would emerge, but not when. Makes sense why he just stayed right here this entire time. How does any of this help me? Tidkrent. Time was shattered here because of what the ancient Nords did to Alduin. If you brought that Kel, that Elder Scroll, back here to the Tid Ahran, the Time Wound, with the Elder Scroll that was used to break time, you may be able to cast yourself back to the other end of the break. You could learn Dragonrend from those who created it. 
Time travel. Do you know where I can find an Elder Scroll? Krosis, no. I know little of what has passed below in the long years I have lived here. You are likely better informed than I. Well, shit. Hmm. That's where Nagar. On gear. I have some idea. Trust your instincts, Dovakin. Your blood will show you the way. Maybe. Um. What do I do with the Elder Scroll when I find it? Return it here to the Teed Ahran. Then, Kele Vomindok. Nothing is certain with such things. But I believe the scroll's bond with the Teed Ahran will allow you a... a seeing, a vision of the moment of its creation. Then you will feel no dragonrend in the power of its first expression. You will see them, Wulfadon, hmm. my friends, Haken, Gormlaith, Feldir. Who are they? The first mortals that I taught the Thum, the first tongues, the leaders of the rebellion against Alduin. They oh. were mighty in their day. Even to attempt to defeat Alduin, Sahrot Hun, the Nords have had many heroes since, but none greater. Well, I'm an orc, so they're not gonna have one either. But now, I'm like, it's just gonna be me. I'm an orc. Too bad. How could an Elder Scroll cast Alduin through the time? Vormindor. I do not know. Perhaps in the very doing, they erased the knowing of it from time itself. The Dove are children of Akatosh. Thus, we are specially attuned to the flow of time. Perhaps also uniquely vulnerable. I warned them against such a rash action. Even I could not foresee its consequences. Nust Lihon, they would not listen. Honestly, I don't even think my WoW is uh, active anymore. <laughs> I can check, but I haven't been on forever. You mean you were there? Yes. There were a few of us that rebelled against Alduin's Thur, his tyranny. I've been so busy. We aided the humans in his overthrow. But they did not trust us, ni of. Their inner counsels were kept hidden from us. I was far from here on the day of Alduin's downfall. But all Dove felt the sundering of time itself. Arthanax, you got... You're long-winded, man. You talk a lot. You got so much to say. What does the Dragon Ren shout actually do? I cannot tell you in detail. I never heard it used. Kogan. It was the first Thum created solely by mortals. It was said to force a dragon to experience the concept of mortality. A truly von Mindoran. Incomprehensible idea to the immortal Dove. Well, goddamn. How, how do they think? I want to know, like, how do they think this up? I have taught the way of the voice for centuries, and the Thum since long before that. But no, Dovakin, others do not come here to train anymore. Saran, you are the first in over a hundred years. Well, goddamn. 
I meditate on the Rotmulag, the words of power. I counsel in their use. It is enough for me. You meditate on the words? How? Knowing a word of power is to take its meaning into yourself. Contemplate the meaning of a Rotmulag. You will become closer to that word as it fills your inner self. Will I teach you, Dovakin? What word calls you to deeper understanding? There are three to master. Fus, Fime, and Yol. Um... This is Fus Roda, yeah? It is called Force in your tongue. But as you push the world, so does the world push back. Think of the way force may be applied effortlessly. Imagine but a whisper pushing aside all in its path. That is Fus. Let its meaning fill you. Sum Ark Mora. You will push the world harder than it pushes back. I wish to meditate on a word of power. I oh, cannot no. take that's not what I want. Drem your look, greetings. Sum Ark Mora. I want to. I want to talk to him. Speak. I will listen. Which calls to you? Fade in your tongue. Mortals have greater affinity for this word than the dove. Everything mortal fades away in time, but the spirit remains. Ponder the meaning of spirit. Unslad Zee. Where mortal flesh may wither and die, the spirit endures. Okay. That is fine. Let that meaning fill you. Sum Ark Mora. You will find that your spirit will give you more strength. Okay. Well, that was a tunnel. That was a huge freaking lore dump. And I love lore, but good God. That was the biggest lore dump we've had in the game. <laughs> so far. Jesus. Lost to learn there, though. Really cool character. I like it. Um, I think that's going to be it for today, though. It's almost 6.30. VB's been scratching to go out for a while now, so... Um, I'm probably going to take her so she can go to the bathroom. Um, so, with that being said, let's save. And then we'll hop over here. Over to the face. Boom. Um, so, that was the end of the week for me. I will be back Sunday morning at 9 o'clock. Um, and we'll be continuing our Final Fantasy IX playthrough. I think we're going to go a little bit longer. Uh, normally, we play from 9 until 11.30. But we're going to try and do our 9 to 1 um, schedule this Sunday. Because um, moving forward, that's going to be kind of like a normal time for me. It's going to be a little weird. Um, next Monday, I have to work because my schedule is kind of messed up. And then the Monday after that, we're having a uh, cleaning company come. So I might do a little bit later stream. We might do like 11 until like 3 Something like that, just to just to stay in the morning. Um, but then, going forward from that point, the schedule is going to be Sunday, Monday, Thursday, nine to one. Um, and I think we're still going to do our two days of Skyrim because we're still playing Skyrim, and then our one day on Sunday will still be our classic RPG day. Um, I don't want to get rid of that. I really love playing classic RPGs, so 
Um, we're going to keep that around. Um, but yeah, moving forward, Mondays and Thursdays, we'll be playing Skyrim and, uh, Sundays will be our, uh, our, um, classic RPG day, which we're playing Final Fantasy IX right now. So, which we're almost done with. So hopefully it doesn't take us too much longer to beat that and we'll move on to something else. But, um, yeah, that's the plan moving forward. Thank you so much for hanging out. Hope you had a good time. Um, and I'll be back on Sunday with Final Fantasy IX. Um, yeah. Thanks again so much. Have a good one. <laughs>